Let's check in with Brian Clark for a modern view on the franchising industry, including whether franchises are worth it and what considerations to undertake. Today we're at our franchisee location in San Francisco, California, Nick and Chelsea Lyon. Great franchisees that have been with the brand for about nine years. Uh, working in the restoration industry is really satisfying because we really enter our customers' lives on the worst day of their life. And it's our job, our mission, our goal to really turn the experience around and make them feel fortunate that they picked up the phone and called us. What makes Stop such a unique franchise is that we present this opportunity to people so much differently than they are being presented by other brands. Working with service team of professionals provides us a great resource, um, business consulting and management to help us navigate um, you know, best strategies for customer service and business development and overall management of um, the business, putting things together like hiring, just kind of really managing all areas of the business and helping us to see the big picture and make positive decisions. My father happens to be the founder of Service Team of Professionals and he set out from big industry to take what he had learned at large companies and recognize that's why they're successful because everything runs to a system, they run to goals, they watch the numbers. So what led me into working with my father was irony, happenstance. I always say I'm lucky to have known the guy that started Stop. He happened to be my father. <laughs> we never considered ourselves a family business. Um, I didn't get the job because I was family. Stop is very, very, very interested in proper fit. We will not sell out for our own benefit a franchise a franchisee into this business. We're we're just honest about the challenges of this industry that we're in, and that way I think we find better franchisees that actually fit. Successful businesses become successful through service and through the customer experience. So number one, be a business person that looks at running your numbers, being profitable, watching your expenses. People that have never been in business, be business before. One piece of advice I would give, and I'm gonna slip in a second piece of advice because I absolutely believe in it, simplify. Try to be simplif simplify and be honest. It, it kind of goes hand in hand. And number two, give, give. Do things right. It's just something I find the more that I give, the more comes back. And you've heard people say that before, but I'm here to tell you, here's another vote that that works. Yeah, the future is just exciting as can be. I'm, I've never been with less stress and I've never been with more excitement for, for what I do for the last 29 years.